Hey everybody, welcome back to Run and Gun. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to create the popular black minimal look, kind of a selective color look. It goes by many names, minimal black. Some people, for some reason, call it black Paris. I guess you could call it black London if you want to, doesn't really matter. And I also made this into a preset for you guys, free to download off my website, therunninggun.com. And the code is hidden in this video, so be sure to watch the whole thing but let's get right into how to create the selective color look in Lightroom. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and reset this image, completely reset back to the beginning, and you're gonna start off by toning your image. So just do the basic corrections that you would do to any photo. I'll white balance the photo, looks all right. And I'll do the basic corrections that I would do to any photo you're just gonna make your photo look as good as you would like it to look, like any normal edit. That looks good to me. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna add some clarity. Now clarity is just gonna make those mid-tones really pop out and give it kind of that clean look. That looks pretty good. Now for the heart and soul of this effect, we're gonna go down to our HSL color sliders, select saturation, and then we're gonna go and turn everything down magenta purple blue aqua green and then I like to turn my yellows down just a touch and desaturate my oranges just a touch and then hit those reds ever so slightly so you can see we are very very close to that kind of black minimal look and it's as simple as that and then I can go around and I can tweak it with my saturation and then tweak the vibrance of those reds that are still there and then go in and make minor tweaks to my tones. Now one other little secret I like to do is go and take my color profile and change it to Adobe Vivid just for that extra little punch. Now one last thing, if you really wanna go in and tweak this look, all you have to do is mess with your color temperature and your white balance. That's gonna change how much color and how much warmth you have in this image. So I can go really blue and have a very minimal red and yellow orange kind of look, or I can add some more warmth to that image, but I like making it nice and cool and really going for those minimal tones. This look works on nighttime photos, this look works on daytime photos, even Spider-Man photos, and of course, photos of London. So that's all for this tutorial. If you guys want the code to download that free preset, that's it right there, WLT8. Seven, one. And you can get that free preset from therunninggun.com. That's where I have all of my Lightroom presets, LUTs, all my good stuff like that. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and share this video with a friend that likes video editing. And until next time, get out and go shoot.